From Creamer Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. Agricultural equipment manufacturer John Deere has evolved from supplying plows more than two centuries ago to farmers being able to control their whole fleet through an app. Malone Arnoldi tells us more about precision farming. In a volatile South African economy, consumers have become price conscious and, at the same time, aware of how technology can help enable cost savings. Commercial farmers have become fewer, but bigger, with help from technology. Farmer Hardy Prinsloo has an 8,000 hectare farm in Dalmas, where he grows maize, soybeans, potatoes and wheat. He uses precision farming equipment across all his operations, from grass cutting and baling, to ploughing and planting, as well as crop spraying, fertilising and harvesting. Prins Leer tells us more about the benefits of precision farming. Precisie boerderij het baie aspekte wat um, vir ons een groot verskil maak. Um, ons het al baie proewe gedoen met toerusting, um, wat ons die, die koste het ons aangaan om, om die toerusting aan te skaf. Uh, net in een seizoen met die dieselverbruik wat ons gespaar het vroeger jare, die toerusting so koste het dek. Um, net in een seizoen. Dan met um, precisie boerderij waar ons die ontledingstrek, rechtstellings doen, um, enorme opbrengsverbetering al vir ons gegeet en opbrengsverhoogings gegeet. Koste bespaar het, waar ons, ons vroeger jare dier die bank kalk gestrooi het, strooi ons net op specifieke plek. Um, saadkoste, want jy gebruik meer en minder saad op die rechte plek, kuns mis die celle. Um, so precisie het een baie brede veld het vir ons een baie, baie groot besparing al te weeggebring. Precision farming has been around in South Africa since 1998, which is not that long ago. Prinsler says he cannot imagine not using precision technology on his operations. It has become vital for commercial farmers to achieve the best possible yield with the lowest amount of input cost to remain competitive. Precision farming enables improved yield by analyzing water levels, ground nutrient levels and adjusting equipment to react accordingly. Prinsler shares his perceptions around precision farming and the necessity thereof in a modern society. In die begin jare, ons het in 1998 met precisie begin en met die toerusting toe was het nog vreselik uh, eenvoudig en so en het het nou baie meer gesofistikeerd geraak en so. Um, so ek dink, allemaal sy perceptie het ook al baie verander en allemaal besef al die waarde daarvan. Um, en ek kan vir jou eerlijk sê, ek kan my nie indink om sonder het te werk nie. Ons, ons werk al vir soveel jare daarmee, dat ek kan nie my indink dat ons daar sonder kan werk nie. En ek kan nie dink dat enige boerderij daar sonder kan werk nie. Dit het dit vir ons so vergemakkelijk en soveel koste besparing al te weeg gebring, dat um, ek nie kan sien dat een boerderij sonder precisie kan bestaan meer vandag nie. To back up this equipment with proper advice, servicing and maintenance, John Deere and its affiliate supplier and service provider Afgrease technicians provide remote service advice. The technicians are able to perform diagnostics on a machine without driving out to the farm to determine a problem. However, this does not come without its challenges, since farms are often in remote areas where signal is scarce. Afgrease precision agriculture specialist Sean Swartz tells us more what the company does to overcome the challenge. The new controllers that John Deere supplied us is uh, with available in 4G controllers. So usually it is 3G, now the signal is a bit better. So we have more connection connected uh, on the equipment. Swartz has worked with precision farming technology for more than 10 years and explains that the technology started out with tracking and has evolved to incorporating an operation center. John Deere's operation center is able to gather data from farming equipment and issue warnings of equipment failure or service reminders to farmers before they even become aware of the problem. Swartz shares how precision farming tech has evolved for him. Well, I have been with AFGRI 11 years in the precision farming business and where it began, it evolved immensely. So about 11 years ago, it was just auto track and signals. Now it's uh, precision farming at its best operation center, it's app applications that you uh, download and you can see your whole fleet on your phone. The farmer can manage his whole fleet on his phone and uh, all the data has been sent to the, the operation center. So you can view everything that's happening on the farm on the applications. That's Creamer Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy.